Good morning, everyone, and welcome to TransWest Truck Trailer RV. We're located in Frederick, Colorado. My name is Larry Vickers. To get a hold of me, simply call the office at 303-684-3404. Today, we're going to do something a little bit different. This is a 2018 Jeep Wrangler Rubicon. The trim level is unlimited. Now in 2018 is when Jeep made their big upgrade from the previous ones. Their market research had showed that a lot of people are using these vehicles as daily drivers. So when they did their upgrade, they kept that in mind to accommodate it as a daily driver, but still maintaining the features that Jeep has been known for. And a couple of those modifications were, as you can see, the windows are larger than they were in the previous Wranglers. That's to accommodate the people using it as a daily driver. Some things we can also notice from the side view is how everything is outlined in red. And once we look at the interior, we're going to notice that as well. As we continue on, let's take a look directly in front of the Jeep. Another improvement that was made is there is 11 inches of clearance from here down. So when you go off-roading, which is what the, this vehicle was designed for, you have more clearance. As you can see, tow hooks located here and here. Now underneath that hood is a 2.0 liter engine. It offers 275 horsepower and 295 foot-pounds of torque. We can see the Rubicon badge located here. And as we take a look at the tires, those are LT 285-70-R-17s. We see the Jeep Wrangler Unlimited right here. Now this vehicle does come with skid plates underneath the entire vehicle. So when you are off-roading, it's gonna protect things underneath. As you can see, this one is a hard top. As we take a look at the interior, we notice the red stitching with the Rubicon written right across the back of the seat. Here is where we make the adjustments to the seat level. You will average about 20 miles per gallon in this Jeep. As we take a look at the back seat, we see the additional stitching that was put in. The Jeep is push start, button start. So simply push the brake and push the button and it fires right up. As we take a look directly behind the vehicle, You see it comes with the spare tow hook located right here. And there are sensors running across the back. As we open it up, storage space located here, in addition to tie downs running all across the back. As we admire the vehicle on this side view profile, since it is a 2018, it does have factory warranty left on the powertrain. The powertrain warranty is five years up to 60,000 miles. So this vehicle just has 28,000 on it. So we still have plenty of warranty left. As we take a look back here, 
If we take a look at the floor, we can see that it is rubber. It comes with rubber floor mats as well, which will help you in cleaning that out after your trip. As we take a look at the console, we can see the vents that kick air into the back seat, along with a couple of charging ports located right there. Inside the passenger seat, we see a bar here to hold on to. It does come with the original manual. Now let's crawl on in and take a closer look. Another advantage to this vehicle in a case where it would work very well are you people that have RVs. This will tow behind an RV very, very well. A couple of the upgrades that were made to it, if we take a look right here, this we can either lock the front and rear differential or simply the rear only. And we can actually do that on the fly. In addition to that, the sway bar, we can actually electronically disconnect the sway bar simply by pushing that button. And what that will allow us to do when we are off-roading, that'll let us actually be able to steer the vehicle even better because we're able to go into to holes or up on rocks, things of that nature, by dislocating the sway bar. As we take a look at the screen, some things we can do from it that we couldn't do before. This does come with heated steering wheel and seats right there. It comes with a backup camera as well. One thing we will do for you is hook up your Bluetooth so when you leave the lot you're completely ready to go. If you take a look at some things on the radio, it does come with presets located right up here. This is Uconnect which comes with all Chrysler products. As we take a look down here, defrost located here. We can turn on the heated steering wheel from here as well. This is for the heated seats and you actually have three options on how much heat you want to come out of the steering wheel. This is for the heated seat on the passenger side. This is for automatic shut off so you can have that on or off. As you know if you have that on and come up to a stoplight or even a stop sign the vehicle will automatically shut itself off. Traction control located right here. Park assist located here. You and I took a look at those sensors. Well, you can either have those on or off simply by pushing a button there. This is hill descent located right here. And you do have the option to completely shut the screen off or turn it on simply by pushing a button right here. This is for the windows. We have a 12 volt charger here. Underneath here is where you can hook up different media outlets. Now this vehicle does come with some auxiliary ports located right here. So if you want to hook up some additional items, you can turn those on or shut those off right here. The vehicle is four wheel drive. That can be done on the fly as well, simply by adjusting this. Here is our e-brake. Now if we take a look at the controller, we see it has park, reverse, neutral, and drive. Now you can shift this to a manual transmission simply by pushing this lever over. And when you should do that, that turns it into a manual transmission. So you can be in whatever gear you decide is best for that specific time. As we, I mentioned, this is a hard top. And you can take that off simply by making these adjustments here, here, and right across. You can take those off or you can take the entire roof off if you decide to. As you look at the console, this pops up, small storage area there, and then that pops up to allow more storage right there. Again, this is a 2018 Jeep Wrangler Rubicon. If you have any other questions about it, please feel free to give me a call. The cell phone number is 970 3704067 the work extension 303 684 3404 
feel free to email me at larry.vickers at transwest.com. Thanks for tuning in today.